I'm Lauren Wilson. And I'm Carly Good. And we're Natural Resource Specialists with the Mississippi Soil and Water Conservation Commission. Today we'll be doing a soil test activity called the JAR Method. In this activity we will be able to find the soil texture and the type of soil we have collected. So Carly, what exactly is soil texture? So it is the proportion of sand, silt, and clay-sized particles that make up the mineral fraction of the soil. Interesting. I guess on that note, we'll turn it over to uh, Chaz and Robin. Hey everybody, my name's Chaz Ingram. And I'm Robin Tisdale. And today, for the jar method, the supplies you're gonna need are basin jars, soil, a measuring cup, spoon, your liquid detergent, and your clean water. First step in the method is you're gonna fill uh, your jars with soil about a quarter to halfway full. Uh, after that, after it's full, you take your water, you fill your mason jar full of water, about three quarters of the way full. After you do that, you take your liquid detergent, tablespoon full, pour your liquid detergent in there, and that's what's going to truly like separate your different, you know, your sand, your silt, your clay. Then you put the top on and you shake. In two to three minutes, come back and make your marks. This is going to be showing your sand layer. Now, after two hours, you'll see that you have your sand layer, your silt layer marks, and now you have to wait for 24 to 48 hours and that'll give you your clay. After you took your ruler and get your measurements on your two jars, you're going to come in here and you're going to find a total height of 5.5 centimeters. After you measure your sand layer, you should come out with a 2.5 centimeters. Then you plug that into the formula with your 2.5 divided by your total height, 5.5 times 100, and that'll give you 45%. You repeat the step of silt, measuring it out. You should end up with 1.3 divided by the height. Total height 5.5 times 100 equals 24%. Then you come back in with clay, which you get 1.7 centimeters. Your total height 5.5 centimeters times 131%. After you calculated all that, you come over here to your soil texture triangle. Once you come to your soil texture triangle, you're going to take the clay, you go to 31% here. You go over here to silt. You come down to 24%. Then you come back over here to your sand and go to 45%. And that's going to leave you with a clay loam as your first soil texture. Then you're going to repeat the step for the second jar. With the second jar, we've got a total height of 6 centimeters. You're going to come back, you're going to measure your sand, you're going to end up with 1.1 divided by your total times 100, gives you 18%. Come in your silt, measure that. It's going to be 0.7. Come in with your total height, times 100, 12%. Then on your clay, you end up with 4.2 divided by the height, times 100, 70%. Then you'll come back to your the triangle. Clay, 70%. Silt, 12%. Sand, 18%. That's going to end up with clay. Your, uh, soil texture. Thanks Chaz. Thanks Carly. Thanks Robin. I think we all learned a lot today. If you have any questions about the JAR method, please contact your local soil and water conservation district.